EOT educator Anjali and we are going to start our syllabus from the chapter number one food and where does it come from we eat food in our daily life right you are sitting here by eating something you have done I think you have done your breakfast your dinner and you take varieties of food in your diet so what you ate today maybe you have eaten chapati roti rice dal or many of you have eaten some meat masala right so the question is where does this food came from why we require this food and how this food is essential for our body so in this chapter food we are going to learn what is food and where does it come from what are the sources of this food and what this food do in our body so we know that there are a variety of food are available in our surrounding as a, if you go to some restaurant uh, you have so many options to order right you can order dosa samba idli then fishes meat curry soup different types of vegetables chapati roti biryani and so many delicious dishes so this seems to be so much variety is present in the food that we eat so what are this food made up of each and everything is made up from something right so there are so many varieties of food we can eat pav bhaji we can eat dosa dhokla and many more dishes which are delicious and tasty for us so let's take small example think about rice how we cook this rice what we do we take some raw rice and boil it in the water so just two material required to prepare the boiled rice what is that rice and water so the substances which required to prepare a food we called it as a ingredients they are ingredients of our food so for preparing rice we need only two material but on the other hand there are so many food items which are made up of many ingredients like if we have to prepare vegetable curry what we need we need different kinds of vegetables salt spices oils and so on to give delicious taste to that curry it means that to prepare any food we require two or more than two ingredients in this table you can see roti chapati right what we require to prepare roti or chapati some atta and water that's it but on the other hand if we want to cook dal we'll need pulses water salt oil or ghee and various spices to give different taste to that food so where do we find all these ingredients do we find some ingredient common for some food items like uh, we need salt for vegetables also we need salt to prepare dal also that means we need different different materials to prepare different types of dishes uh, from which some materials repeat themselves while cooking different dishes so what happens how these ingredients are available to us how we use them to prepare our food what are the food materials and what are the sources what type of nutrition this food provide us to our body we are going to learn about all these in this in our chapter number one food and where does it come from so this was just an introductory video in our next session we will learn how these food material are available and what are the different sources of this food material until then keep learning thank you for watching this video